Hi everyone, welcome back to Game Fish in Ireland. Uh, once again, thanks for the likes and subscribes on the videos. Um, going to take a, a little break from tying wet flies for a couple of patterns. Um, going to tie some some dry flies, and I'm going to do some some CDC flies. Um, so I might start off with with something that doesn't require a whole lot of materials, but is a really really effective fly. So I'm going to start off with an F-fly, so you really can have thread and CDC. Um, you can dub the body on some of them, you can um, put a hackle on the front of some as well, just as a variant. Um, but I'm going to start off with one, and it's it's pretty hard to go wrong tying an F-fly, unless maybe um, you might see occasionally uh, some novices where they the wings roll, you know, they sort of roll around the hook. And that's just because they don't have a bed of thread behind the eye. So, um, with the wets, you'll often see might bring the the tying thread back to two mil or so from the eye when I'm starting off the thread on the hook, um, and that's just to keep the that area a little bit thinner, a little bit neater, um, and smaller head on the wet, especially for the traditional lock style flies because you have a lot of materials and are bulky, and you're trying not to have the head of the fly too bulky. Which um, you know some of the some of the lighter sparser flies, uh, you can start um, with the tread directly behind the eye. And, you know that's that's important um, for something like an F fly because otherwise your your wing might roll around onto the side of the the hook. Um, and look, you're going to be using pretty thin tread for small flies, so a couple of turns behind the eye shouldn't shouldn't matter. The other thing is again, you're always saying. Um, is, is, to, is to put some wax on the tread uh, just to give you extra grip. So I'm going to be tying a few flies um, just if you're into tying with CDC uh, <clears throat> um, it's a good book hopefully you'll be able to see it um, here it's uh, it's tying flies with CDC um, The Fisherman's Miracle Feather by Leon Lynx uh, and that has a whole range of um, patterns from, from tires around the world that are known for using um, CDC, including Kratnik, who is the guy who um, came up with the F-Fly. And um, I just see here, just looking at this, that uh, back in the day, I bought, I bought it in Bowman's Tackle Shop in, in, in Waterford, which was, a, was a, an Aladdin's cave, really, um, of tying materials in at the back of a jeweler shop. Um, sadly there's there's no tackle shop in the town now and um, it cost 28 pounds 50 so um, it's a hardcover book so um, yes time flies with CDC um, and it's a, if you can get your hands on it really useful um, good range of CDC patterns particularly if you're into river dry fly um, be useful 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 book to have so um, we might start as I say with with the F fly <laughs> 